y'all! Welcome back to my channel, Kentucky Fried Fun, and welcome if you're new. Today, I am going to be doing a cleaning video. I'm going to be cleaning our master bedroom, my VIP kid room, our master bathroom, the living room, and finally the kitchen. If you are in need of some cleaning motivation, keep watching. If you are new to my channel, my name is Ruth, and on my channel, I like to share cleaning motivation. If you like that type of content, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe. And then once you have clicked that red subscribe button, be sure to also click the little bell below. That will notify you of when I have a new video, and give this video a big thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that this gives you the cleaning motivation that you need. The first thing that I like to do every morning after I am finished teaching is just go ahead and make my bed. That way I am not tempted to get in it for the rest of the day. On this particular day that I was cleaning, I typically try and clean our house on Tuesdays. We had just been on a vacation visiting our friends, so I had the suitcase I wanted to go ahead and unpack and get all of that put away. Once I had put everything away, it was time to go ahead and dust. I'll be dusting our nightstands, my vanity, and our dresser. To be doing so, I'll be using just a plain old rag and some good, great value furniture polish. Nothing special. I'm still trying to use this bottle up. Trust me, I do use it, but it lasts forever, which is a good thing, I guess. I'll be using the same stuff when I go and dust in our living room as well. After I have finished dusting in our bedroom, I will then just be moving on into the bathroom that if you can see the shower curtain right there, that is actually our bathroom and it's pretty cool because it has a sliding door that goes into our master bedroom but then also a normal door that goes out to the hallway. And I will be just using the scrubbing bubbles to spray down the sink, the toilet, and the tub. Next, I'll just be using some comment to sprinkle in the toilet and this glass cleaner that probably the last time I'll be using it because there's literally like a drop to spray on the mirror. After I have sprayed down the mirror, I'll then just begin removing everything off our countertop and I'll be wiping down the mirror, the counter, the toilet, the tub, and just to let you know, even though they are all white rags, I am using a separate rag for each area.
I'm done in our master bathroom, I'm moving on into my VIP kid room, which if you have followed me before, you may not recognize this. This is new. This is kind of the reason why I have been MIA here on YouTube, because I've really been plugging myself here into my new job with VIP kid, which if you don't know what that is, it's basically teaching ESL English as a second language to Chinese students online. I absolutely love it and it's just it's been an amazing um, experience and a nice side income and now that I've kind of got my routine down I'm ready to get back into YouTube. showing you my emoji pillow that I love using for silly as well as my dino pillow which if you don't know VIP kid dino is basically VIP kids mascot moving on to the other side of my room our office room we actually have had this printer for a couple of years and just now got around to setting it up and below you'll see one of my Christmas gifts it is a laminator and I'm so loving using it to make props and things for VIP kit now I am moving on into the living room and just putting things away before I start dusting Like I mentioned earlier, I'm just using the same Great Value Furniture Polish and a different rag to dust off the pieces of furniture in our living room. Last room before vacuuming. First, I'm just going to be clearing things away before I start doing all of the dishes. Here are a couple things I had purchased at the Target Dollar Spot. Some adorable pencil socks for a dollar. And then this bin that says make your own magic. It's orange and it's so perfect for my VIP kid room. You'll see later how I end up using it. And here I am just going to be showing y'all an adorable pot I also found at the Target Dollar Spot for $5. I'll be using it to decorate my entryway. And just look at this most adorable spoon that my sister-in-law got me for Christmas. It says blend with the giggles. Oh my, somehow she knows me so well. Now to start on this mound of dishes. And while I'm washing these dishes, I thought I would go ahead and let y'all know some exciting news. My husband actually had just started his own channel. If you have followed my channel from the beginning, you would have seen him. We actually started this channel together talking about our financial peace journey. His channel is called Michael's Money and on his channel you will learn things about passive income, side hustles, and 
personal finance. If that type of thing interests you, go ahead and head on over to his channel, hit his red subscribe button, click on that bell so you don't miss out on his videos. He'll be coming out with one weekly and give his video a big thumbs up and be sure to comment down below letting him know that his dear wifey sent you over there. Now that I'm finally done with all of those dishes, it seems like it took forever. I'm just going to scrub out the sink and wipe it down. This is one of my absolute favorite things to do in the kitchen. It just makes it seem so much more cleaner. Now that the sink is all wiped out, I'm just going to be going around the kitchen and wiping down the countertops. And to do so, I'm going to be using Mrs. Meyer's um, all purpose spray and I believe this one is in the mint scent anyways I love all of her products all of her scents I have pretty much all of the seasonal ones as well as a couple everyday ones and I did want to let y'all know that I do have a code that I will leave linked down in the description box that if you click on that it will direct you to the Grove website where you can get a free set for your first purchase of $20 now that I have the whole house clean, I am just going to go through and give the first floor a good vacuum. Our second floor, if you are new to my channel, is actually where our Airbnb is. So I'm just cleaning the first floor of our house, but I'm just giving it a nice good vacuum. And to do so, I'm actually using my Dyson vacuum that my hubby got me a last year, I think it was. And I absolutely love it. Not having to have a cord, it is amazing. And here's that beautiful pot that I found at the Target Dollar Spot the other day. And inside it, I will just be sticking some flowers that I found at Dollar Tree last spring. I absolutely love to decorate. I actually mentioned that the other day on my Instagram as part of a VIP Kid Challenge that I am doing. And it was about what is your favorite hobby, and I put decorating. So if you do want to follow me over on Instagram, I do try and post on there daily so I will leave my handle here down below so you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram and here's just a quick overview of how everything turned out after I cleaned I ended up using this basket to stick my fun headbands and glasses in that I like to wear for classes and I absolutely love a clean house, so it always makes me feel so good after cleaning. And I hope that this video gave y'all some motivation to get some cleaning done yourself. If it did, again, please be sure to leave my video a big thumbs up. If you like what you saw, hit that red subscribe button and click that little bell so that you don't miss out on my next cleaning video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. Bye!